New York. Brooklyn. What part of Brooklyn? Um, Brooklyn, New York, and space. That's what's up. Sunshine, nobody else. Thank for yourself. We got Miss Astrid. Telling you what you need to do. What you need to do. Get up in the morning. Hey. What's going on? Justin Skaggs here from Style and Strings Across with Connor Wilson from LacrosseAllStars.com. One of the largest internet blogs based around the cross. You guys put your questions on YouTube and now we're going to ask them. In like Twitter version, like 140 characters or less, what's Lacrosse All Stars? website we talk about everything from the youngest kids playing the game all the way up to the pros I mean, chances are if you're doing something good in the lacrosse world we're probably talking about you we're going to open up with the heaviest hitting question how do you keep your hair so luxurious that's a good question actually i, I don't wash it that often it's a silly stupid answer and sometimes it's a little smelly but that's that's the truth you can't overwash it Uh, did you play in college? And this one comes from Sean Scott again. This is the second one you did. Yes, I did. I played in college. Where at? I played at Wesleyan University in Connecticut, part of the mighty, mighty NESCAC. What is that? New England Small College Athletic Conference. NESCAC? It's like a French swear word. <laughs> Actually, okay. NESCAC! NESCAC! You know, they're like, oh. Okay, so you played for the NESCAC. I played, and I'm not, I'm not messing with you here, for the club division called the PSAC. <laughs> PSAC. Let's see what Pennsylvania State Athletic, Athletic Conference. Conference. Don't want to come over here and judge my PSAC. You're over there with your NESCAC. Oh, here's a good one. Emmanuel Brown. What do you think of the new four-inch rule that's going to be instituted in 2016? He only wrote like three words, but I think that's what he means. I think that's fair. I actually have the new stick I, I strung up here, and uh, you know, this is a it's got a nice little channel in it, but it's only got two shooters. It's, you know, definitely passes the four-inch rule. Too? Uh, and I dyed it. Yeah, I, I got some hidden talents. Got her. And uh, you know, I I don't think it's a bad rule. I think kids are really getting to the point of looking for hold and control in their stick above being able to pass the ball. So, you know, I'm, I'm hopeful at least to get things. I don't think you can really mandate change with rules, but the double and triple Bs I thought were uh, a tad excessive. What was your first stick? Uh, my first stick that I was really playing with was a STX Golden High Wall, which had pink Golden High, golden high, wall. high wall, which meant it had pink and neon green traditional stringing of black leathers. That was that was like the stick of Alright, Sarah Griffiths wants to know your idol back in the day. Your lacrosse idol. That's a good question. Um, I guess I'd probably say a guy named Brendan Glass, who was from Lincoln Sudbury High School in Massachusetts went on to play at UMass. He's an All-American there. I mean, you're always looking for that guy who's like, he's a hometown guy. Brendan Glass. Lincoln Brendan Sudbury. Glass? Yep. All right, Brendan Look Glass, if you're watching this, nailed it.